AMP played its part in ensuring the Olympic spirit united the people of Australia. The Olympic Journey, a national celebration of the Sydney 2000 Olympic Games, featuring parades and exhibitions, travelled around Australia, covering 116,000 kilometres and reaching 500,000 Australians. The Olympic journey, supported by AMP, provided an opportunity for all Australians to become more actively involved in the lead-up to the Sydney 2000 Olympic Games. Australians were given a unique way to share the Olympic spirit and immortalise their family name in an important community artwork. Sign for the dream. Men, women and children from all walks of life signed their names and recorded messages of support on terrazzo floor pieces at each of the 23 cities visited during the journey. Eminent artist David Humphreys was commissioned to design and create the artwork to be placed at Sydney's Darling Harbour as a permanent symbol of the Olympic journey. After preparing the site and selecting the best pieces of marble, glass and bronze for inclusion in the artwork, the discs were put in place. Then sandblasting and polishing procedures were used to form a hard, permanent surface to preserve forever the names and well wishes of 25,000 Australians. And I think that the, the essence of the whole project really is about the community's real willingness to queue for hours in the hot sun in places, to actually make their own personal statement in their own writing as a wish and a gesture and symbol of goodwill for the Olympics. So AMP have been very integrated into the whole project. The staff volunteered their time all over the country and there was enormous goodwill. And it, it sort of really linked AMP as people back into the community that they are working with. When we were out there with the Olympic journey in 1997, there were huge crowds, but there were also big queues, and the big queues were there to sign the discs that would become the artwork that we're unveiling today. And I remember watching many people queue. My own family queued at Cronulla to sign the disc, and people were standing three or four metres in front of me. The view was no better but they were in the pouring rain just to be closer, just to feel and touch the excitement and the experience of the athletes and the others that were involved in that great parade. They've made history, not by competing in the Games, but by embracing the Olympic spirit, supporting the Games, and sending some heartfelt messages of goodwill to the athletes that will compete into them and the many visitors who will grace our shores next year. So AMP is proud to be part of this exhibition, of this artwork, to have supported it and to present this artwork from the people of Australia to the Sydney 2000 Olympic Games.
our family wrote, and it reads, May your dreams be your inspiration and your inspiration. You see it all written down here is just, it's unbelievable. I feel like getting down and trying to find my name. It's, it's, it's really great. And, you know, my hometown, Ballarat Club. The big boat with the red jumper. He enticed me to go up, and I, uh, at first I wouldn't go, and then he said to me, come on, come on, come on, and he took me by the hand and took me right to the top of the queue. I said, there you are, put your name there. <laughs> I think you actually wrote 